Okay, we're back. Deuce is dry. Uh, I've been drying him for about an hour and uh, he's all dry. I've checked under the armpits, underneath his belly. I've been able to see his skin all the way around his body. I find baths a phenomenal time to check over your dog from head to toe to see if there are any scabs, if there are any um, other issues that you need to be taking care of, growths. It's really a great time to get to know your dog's body inside and out. I've been able to identify cysts or lumps, unfortunately, by my, and hot spots are a big, big thing that you can see when you're drying your dog. So make sure that you take this time to go over your dog from head to toe. Um, something else I wanted to talk about was getting your dog used to the dryer. I've had all sorts of uh, responses from dogs when drying them. I start from young puppies at eight weeks old and on uh, a low powered dryer and we just do the from the shoulders back and I start to introduce them to the head but some one way I get dogs used to the head is I give them a piece of food a jerky treat that is a good jerky treat and I feed them while I'll dry their head the tops of their heads I turn to a low power I'm very conscientious about the ears um, making sure not to get inside their ears but really helping them it's basically a lure but it's also a reward for them letting me do their head but you should be washing your puppy every month um, as they're young so they get used to the dryer it's a scary experience at first treats make it better good talking to them making sure you always have a hand on your dog until they're used to the table in the dryer as you're drying them because you don't want a dog to go off the table so you add them you want to make it safe and, and happy for them so they enjoy this time hi buddy <laughs> he's like I like those toy those treats um, I actually had to move my grooming table over um, I was standing on an anthill and my feet were getting bit from the first part of this video so we truly are on the same day when we started so anyway um, just make sure your dog is clean and if you've got dead hair coming out work on that that spot on the dog until the dead hair stops coming out it's the best way to get the the dead coat off your dog so happy grooming